We have made it to level 9, Goromark Temple 1. This uh, is a massive, massive level. That actually spans to the next level as well, the Goromark Temple 2. This is one of the hardest levels in the game, if not the hardest, apart from the uh, the final final level. Temple Entrance. Um, there's a lot of puzzles here. There's a lot of really bad guys. There's one way there. Hello. And let's just see what we can do here. Whoop, you were not frozen. I thought you were going to be frozen. Now you are dead. So this level introduces this. I don't know if, yeah, we actually broke it. These are like, uh, just, you know, banish. You rip them apart with your weapons and destroy everything. Uh, there might be secrets, there might be clues, there might be absolutely nothing in there. But you know, they're there to try out what... I can still hear that Goarkathan moving about, and I don't like that. So here, it has a button. And another Goarkathan. And we are in... The Holy Scriptures area. Oh, there's a button. Oh, not a button, a key. Of course. Let's put that there. And what do we have here? We have some cloaked men worshipping something, a mechanism in the mountains. So that's very interesting. We, the Order of Sacred Fire, have given an oath to protect the Inner Sanctum and guard the Undying One that lives, that is held below. This we shall promise with our lives and for all ages to come. Well, that's nice. Two times left she slid this. Once right, once left. Three times right, and twice more is left. This she repeats twice. That seems important somehow. So let's let's hold on to that. So there's that way. I guess we'll look in here. And there's a bit of food. Guess we'll give that to Balrog. Balrog is a big guy. He's a minotaur, so he needs the food, you know. Whoa! Now this room here is the checkered room. Let's have a look. There are a lot of, of banners and buttons, and here's a scroll. This is the checkered room. Don't let it fool you. Well, okay. The checkered room is actually a fairly easy puzzle. Um, what you do is you just put stuff. Unst I guess I'll use a shuriken for this. In a checkered pattern. And, you know, it's not going to be too difficult to figure out for anybody. And then the door opens. And then it closes. And it opens again. So you just want to make sure that you have something there so that you don't need to... Well, otherwise you'd be Fubert, right? Let's move along. You hear that? That's a nasty sound. <laughs> miss! How did you miss a, a curtain? On the ground. I mean... So, oh, not on, on, hanging on the wall. The Armory! That sounds like a place I want to go. Especially if I can freeze my enemies like that. Excellent. So we got some arrows, which we can't use. We got a lightning bomb, which we can use. And now you are full. I think what we will do is just eat some... There we go. Food is nice. We got a, a long sword. I don't need no long sword. Got a ring mail. Uh, but it's worse than what we have. And an iron bassinet. Which is also worse than what we have. Seems a bit excessive. Let's karate chop. Wah! And and a button. With some more friends. Oh! The, today was not your day, mate. We found an axe, Norja. So if we had an axe guy, he could have used that, but we don't. And 
all we got out from the armory was a bit of experience and five arrows. Which is fine. No. Let's continue down this hallway here. And see where it takes us. Hmm. I must have taken a wrong turn somewhere. Hmm. Have you figured this out yet? Because I have. If you notice, right there, there's a little uh, loop on the wall. If we go through it, or go, you know, one step, just watch the damn wall. It changed. And in fact, all it did was turn us around. And again, turned us around. And that's just a tiny little, little puzzle corridor there. Temple Grounds! Trespassers will be hunted down. This is probably the most unnerving area in the whole game. Uh, you have been warned. Why is it unnerving? Well, there are a few enemies in here that we're going to have to deal with. Oh, there's nothing there. And the you... Here you go. These particular enemies can't... Uh, they are frost, frost lizards, so as you can imagine, um, they don't do well, or, you know, frost attacks doesn't really do much for them. Now, on their own, they're pretty easy to deal with. I mean, you can dodge them just as, as well as you can dodge any other enemy. And they drop these nice uh, stakes. The stakes are high. And these stakes are really great. Oh, did you see that? Because they will, um, they will pretty much, you know, feed you fully. Um, but the lizards are so difficult to kill. They'd have a lot of, of, of damage. Or they do, do they ha oh, oh, Curly Brace can't walk. I'm going to use these um, bombs against the lizards just to help myself out a bit. And then we're going to go through this very methodically. Oh, button. This button's open. This button opens up a little door in here where we will find a lightning bomb a fire bomb I guess I'll put that there and pit fighters gauntlets these give this is not really a melee weapon but it does buff melee you know fighter unarmed fiber blah 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 you, you get the picture plus three protection plus two strength and attack power when unarmed so they are perfect for Bower. And that also means we can get rid of these uh, ring gauntlets that Curly Brace was carrying around. She's still, you know, carrying around a lot of weight, but she doesn't look to be a large insectoid, does she? But, you know, she is. So what you want to do here is not get cornered by these this sets here. Just want to take it easy. Trying to work. Oh, I I did get cornered right there. Keith gained a level, so that's very nice. Not gonna use that right here though. There's a door there, an iron door. And I just want to take it real slow. In this area, these lizards, they will continue to spawn forever and ever. So it's actually a pretty good place to, you know, grind some XP if you need to. But it also means, you know, taking a lot of damage and, well, you know, you can rest through that. Got a scroll of lightning bolt. Not really something we need, but I'll, I'll hang on to it for now. Uh, let's pump that into swords. Let's save because this is not... Are there any buttons in here? There's not. Not at all. Whoa! Shit. God dang it, Lizard. A lesser man would have been scared of that. But, you know, of course, I didn't get scared. That was just a, uh, a war cry. And not a scream. Hello? Uh, 
the way you would do this if you uh, if you really want to grind is you would kill some and then you would you know go rest and while you're resting how uh, they would respawn there we go I think there's more as well they would respawn and then you would kill some more if you're just chucking through this as I am it's generally not an issue you're gonna meet a few and it's not like you want to get cornered by these these dudes here. So I'm just gonna, you know, keep on trotting through this. No buttons? No buttons. Any but no buttons. See, now I can't dodge them, and that's bad, but hopefully... There we go. It did die. Uh, I'm gonna put that on. Yeah, darn it. Oh, there you go. So let's just try and not die from these bastards. If we can. And we can actually try to not die. You, you get my point. It's a circle of war. I don't feel like I have time to really look at that right now. So I'm just going to keep that for later. You know I'll forget it, but you know. Because I really don't like this area here. I can hear them moving about. I think I have a firebomb somewhere. There we go. We'll put that on. Haha, <laughs> you don't like it. Oh, God! Shit, fuck. Okay, now we are in big trouble here. Oh, I let them corner me. Let's not do that again. Well, we'll do that as in kill them. I'm gonna try and get the firebomb out. Let's whoop! See, that's the problem with these ice lizards, is that if you let them catch you, then you are potentially very screwed. Whew. Yeah, that was a good idea, Keith. Hit the air a bit. That'll scare it off. So this is actually, I think, the only enemy in the game that is immune to fire. Uh, to frost, sorry. Okay. Well, I get that back to Curly Brace. I guess she can eat that. No, <clears throat> not enough. There we go. Whew, I'm gonna close that and then just check over here. I don't hear any more of them. Oh, I saw a shadow move. Hello. Little friend. You just don't want to get caught between them because that means your rear guys are going to take some damage. <laughs> rear guys, that sounds a bit, a bit dirty. We have another lightning bomb, so I guess we'll use that for a bit more. If we can find a few more just to expend these lightning bombs, that would be excellent. Let's close that. Look in here. Whew. There's another tar bead. And this is the actual end of this little area here. So thankfully, we, we got through that fairly unscathed. It's going to rest a bit. But that is a very, very difficult place to... Oh, hello. <clears throat> it's our old friend. You need to be careful. They live here, and they will want to stop you. They fear you might undo their vision. 
I might just do that, you know? Hoop de doop doop do. That's good enough. We'll be fine. So, don't think I'm going to be needing those bombs anytime soon, so I'm just going to put those there. We'll move on into the outer sanctum. There is a hole there, or a keyhole there. And these guys are nasty. Haha! -ha! Not today. Ayo! That was another war cry. That was done. Ow! It really sucks because it hurts a lot when they do that. So imagine if you couldn't move away from these guys. That would be really bad. So there's some... There are my bolts there. Where are my bolts at? So let's have a look around here. Hands that slaughter, eyes that deceive. Curious. And it just teleports us back to where we came from. Oh. Three ancient, be ancient beings of deep. Hmm. Oh, what's this? A scroll. That just says 3213. That's nice. We have the circlet of war. And I guess since it's nothing, I will put that on Balart. Which means I can put this one on Quote. Get rid of that. Because that's light armor. Let's take out the last room here. Which says, Son of Hatred. So that's the hints for this puzzle. We got this um, the scroll. 3213. Son of Hatred, there's one son. In, well, at least in our world. Who knows about, you know, the world that Grimrock is in. Eyes that slaughter, hands that slaughter, eyes that deceives. That's two. And the three would be in here. I mean, we don't know what kind of world this is. So, you know, because I, I don't have know any insectoids or lizard men. So we're going to go three, two, one... And if we've done this correctly, we should be able to go into three again and... Oh! <laughs> I meant to do that. 